anti-abortion groups in mainly Christian Kenya celebrated the U.S. Supreme Court's overturning of the right to abortion in June, calling it a divine intervention. Abortion is murder, and the abortionists are also murderers. So when I see that the Supreme Court is choosing life, that is the way to go. Kenya has upheld the right to abortion, but only for health reasons, leading many women to seek unsafe, illegal abortions on demand. After watching her friend bleed to death from one such abortion in Nairobi, 20-year-old Diana, not her real name, sought professional help when she wanted an abortion. I went to a good clinic and the doctor took me through the process. Now I'm fine, as you can see. I'm all well. I'm healthy and I don't have any complications. But like many abortion rights supporters in Africa, Diana worries the U.S. top courts overturning the abortion right could encourage more legal restrictions in Kenya and lead to more deaths. The World Health Organization says 75% of abortions in Africa are unsafe. Kenya's Ministry of Health estimates 2,600 women and girls die each year from complications related to unsafe abortions. That is 35% of all maternal deaths. There is a high rate of maternal deaths resulting due to unsafe abortions because these women are denied the right to have the safe abortion services. Former U.S. President Donald Trump restricted funding to developing countries' reproductive health as part of the so-called guardrail against abortion. Abortion rights campaigners say that was the first sign that more action will be needed to protect the right at home. While the U.S. has been very generous in supporting our health systems, we must be more proactive ourselves and have the right laws, the right practices that favor access to reproductive health, including abortion care. Kenya has gradually liberalized its abortion laws to allow, in 2019, termination for sexual violence. A judge ruled in March this year that abortion care is a constitutional right and even cited the U.S. Supreme Court Roe v. Wade decision that was then overturned in June. That ruling is being challenged and Kenya's abortion rights advocates worry the U.S. change in law might affect the final decision. Juma Majanga for VOA News, Nairobi.